Hello viewers, welcome to another project tutorial by Project Maker. In this video, I will be teaching you how you can create a word frequency counter program which will count the frequency of word in given text file. Before starting this video, if you are new to this channel, then hit the subscribe button and click on bell icon to watch my video first. Now, without wasting any time, let's move to our computer screen. As you can see, I have already open python projects for beginner playlist in front of you where i uploaded a lot of python projects for beginners now let's add another project to this playlist for that let's move to our destination folder so this is our destination folder which is empty now let's create a text file first so i will just right click here and just click new and just text document and just title that document as test and just open this file and I will just type uh, let's say welcome to my channel full stop and then I will write this is frequency counter tutorial and python 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 for frequency counter this is the data of our test file now let's close this file and just open this folder in vs code with this option if this option is not present in your system you can simply come to the folder and just open cmd here and just type code space dot and just hit enter it will open vs code in the same folder now let's move back to our VS code. I will create a new file first, which will be main.py. Let's zoom the screen. Our first task will be storing the file name in a variable. So I will just create a variable which is file name and just store the file name. So the name of our file is test.text. So I will just write test dot text. After that, we will be creating a function which will process the file and just return us a dictionary of word and frequency of that word. So for that, I will simply write uh, let's say output and word frequency. and just pass the file name to this function as you can see it is giving me error because the function is not created yet so let's create that function i will just write def the function name frequency and just take input as file so our function is created successfully now our first task will be importing the file data in our program so for that i will just type with open it takes two parameter which is first will be file and the mode so we will be reading the file in reading mode so i will just type r which means read as f after that I will show you the data first so I will just print the file data so for that I will just write f dot read read command will simply give me the data of that file so I will run the program as you can see this is the data of our file which is correct as you can see I will just show you the data now so this is the text file and this is the data so the data is same now let's close the file and just close the output to count the frequency of each word in file we will first divide the line according to the new line and then i will store the result in list then after that i will iterate through each word in list and just increment the frequency now let's do the practical implementation so that you can better understand what am i saying so for that i will just write for line which is particular line in f now i will just store the output in a list which is 
sentence underscore list and just type line dot firstly I will replace the unwanted character so for that I will just type replace so in our program dot is only the character and I will just replace it with blank and then use split function which will split the sentence according to the space I will just show you the output by printing sentence list now let's run the program as you can see the file data is split according to a new line so this was the first line of our program which is split into words this was second line and this was third line so till now everything is ok now we have to count the frequency of each word so for that I will just write here let me comment this for word in sentence list if word in word frequency word frequency is a dictionary and it is giving me error because I have not declared it so I will just declare the word frequency as an empty dictionary it is done and I will simply write don't worry I will explain in the source code just concentrate what am I am doing now else what frequency of all equal to 1 and I will simply return the dictionary so this is our program I will just show you the output by printing the output variable here uh, ok now we will just run the program as you can see the frequency is coming back to me and it is accurate so I will show you the reason firstly we imported entire file data in our program after that we break the entire file data according to the lines and created a list where we store the words present in the line which means welcome to my channel after that we iterated to the particular list and check whether the word is already present in our dictionary or not if the word is present in our dictionary we just incremented the counter using plus equals one else which means the word is not present in our dictionary so we just added that word by making the frequency of that word 1 here then the last line is the return so after processing the file we simply return the dictionary here now as you can see the dictionary is looking very ugly or not understandable so let's make it understandable so for that I will just write for key value in output dot items so items is a function or say method which is used to iterate in dictionary so I will just print I will be using f string here then key space value now let's run the program to show the final output as you can see the output is more clear to us that the frequency of welcome is 1, 2 is 1, my is 1 and the frequency of python is 3 which was correct. So this was our entire program to count the frequency of each word in given text file. So this was all about today's video. If you want source code of today's tutorial you can simply visit my blog website which is projectmaker.me So this is blogging website of my youtube channel you will get the video material of today's tutorial in this blog website if in case you are watching this video after few months you can use this search feature to search the particular blog i will show you the demo uh, let's say we want to search this virtual environment using python so i will just type here virtual and just hit enter it will just open the virtual environment using python on windows as you can see so this is a blog 
that I have created and the commands to create virtual environment. In the similar way, you will also find today's blog. So let's move back to our program or VS Code. So here comes the end of this video. If you like this video, then don't forget to share it with your family and friends. Thanks for watching this video.